Hey, hi, I'm Crazy Chris, and welcome to So Cool Science. Science you can do right at home. I'm just sitting here with my pal Rosie, and today's science file says, How can I study spiders every day? Well, that's an excellent question. You definitely want to try this. You will need an aquarium, aquarium gravel, some decorations, a tarantula, and most importantly, an adult. Okay, the very first thing you gotta do is get yourself an aquarium. No, 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 not one that already has fish in it. I'm talking like this. Whoa! Fill the aquarium with the aquarium gravel. You can use a container to put the rocks in the aquarium. But I prefer the fast method. Okay, now you want to get yourself some decor. You know, because I'm going to take it slowly. Ow! Fill your aquarium with rocks, plants, sticks, and anything else that won't harm your tarantula. Make sure you have a hiding spot for your tarantula, and make sure you have something for the tarantula to drink water. Last but not least, make sure you have a top to pop on top of your tarantula's home. Ha <laughs> ha! I mean, you wouldn't want your tarantula, you know, ending up in uh, your sister's bed. Okay, now it's time to introduce Rosie into her brand new home. Uh, uh where is Rosie? Uh, have you guys seen Rosie? What, Rosie? Rosie, come here. Where, where'd you go? Carefully set your tarantula in its brand new home. Whoa, these tarantulas are so cool. Now, how do you take care of these guys anyway? Well, don't look at me. Take a closer look at this. Tarantulas are a part of a group of spiders called the Mygalomorphae, which evolved about 230 million years ago. All Mygalomorphae still possess the primitive four book lungs, their size, and the up and down fangs. Because tarantulas still possess the primitive mindset, they can and will bite if provoked, although the venom isn't poisonous to humans. A good place to put your tarantula's new home is in your room temperature bedroom. Tarantulas are nocturnal, which means they prefer to be active at night, and they do not like direct light. A good thing to do is cover your tarantula's home with a sheet during the day. Make sure your tarantula has fresh water every day. They eat insects like crickets or mealworms. Make sure to feed your tarantula one or two times a week. Never put your hand in the tank. When there are crickets in there, the spider will see your fingers as lunch. So now you can study spiders anytime you want. You know, having your very own pet tarantula is why science is so cool. Look out!